Miss K's dating agency described him perfectly. Sexy, confident, intelligent, with a healthy bit of ego. He was also a gifted artist, having his first major art exhibition. He did, and he had invited me to a gallery where his paintings were on display after learning about me through Miss K. Very good. Stop running. Because <laughs> I need this. Stop running. <laughs> <laughs> Harry insisted on paying for the taxi from the gallery to the iconic downtown hotel where I booked a room. There in the backseat of the cab, I let my legs intertwine with his and slid the hem of my skirt to the curve of my thighs. <laughs> Uh, what are you smoking? I'm smoking a pipe. <laughs> I'm an old man in a chair by a roaring fire, smoking a pipe, reading this light blue, excuse me, <clears throat> light blue, blue hued laser beams burning through my womanly secrets. I watched with bated breath as Cody scanned my crisscrossed legs, searching for an entry between them with his rolling hand. I blocked his advances at first, just for fun, wanting his fingers to sweep my. Pussy lips. Before our mouths blended for our first kiss, he was eager and wanting. I wondered about this curious young man's fingers sliding into my wetness. His hands thoroughly checked for rough edges while we strolled the gallery. And besides a fleck of paint here and there, his manicure heightened my expectations. <laughs> The conversation I had with Miss K had me stimulated with my juices, and there was a throb in my pelvis that wouldn't mellow. <laughs> Cody had sent me at least a dozen photos throughout the day of his muscular, bare chest, and, <laughs> and the view of his pants pulled down to his sexy, dark brown. Not to be confused with my turban. Or your eyebrows. Or my eyebrows. <laughs> he knew how to make a pussy wet. And I wanted to invite him over to my house so I could spend the night dosed in his cup. Doused. Doused. <laughs> doused. Doused. Like I did at the hotel. I made, a, I made a proposal and accepted an invitation. Though, and until I received a reply from Cody or Autumn, my next sexual encounter was rather up in the air. <laughs> it's time for Dirk to do his rendition. It's time for Dirk to do his <laughs> Hello, Belair. Autumn, arri Autumn <laughs> arrived dressed in sick beige dress that skimmed her elegant curves. Her auburn hair was like seeth. Did I say that right? What is it? Was, was, was like a sheath. A sheath. A sheath. Sheet. Sheet. Over her sexy <laughs> shoulders. And the, and you can't give me those words. I know, right? <laughs> when we can break the floral perfume, she dabbed on her neck, left his scented scents on it. <laughs> You're reading two more sentences. I know, right, huh? And I wonder if she lays her pussy with it, too. Oh, damn. Okay. <laughs> wait, wait, wow, is okay. he getting the boner? He's getting the boner. Like, Hold on, He's wait. getting the boner as he's reading this. My body is on. <laughs> I remember, I remember that scent. I whispered, kissing her cheek. Oh, wait a minute. Shit. Yeah, it's dirty shit, man. Dirty shit. It's dirty shit. I, I like this book. Yeah, I do too. <laughs> you should read the whole thing. I remember that scent. I whispered, kissing her cheek. All of me then kissed my glossy lips before we find. I remember yours too. Ooh. <laughs> Thrilled to have you here. Observing the lust in her eyes when Cody joined us and offered our affectionate hug. Please make yourself comfortable. <laughs> oh, I'm very comfortable, she replied. <laughs> the three of us came together in autumn in the middle. The men are familiarizing and synchronizing our seductive moments. Her purse still dangled from her shoulder and bounced her hips at the sway. <laughs> The chemistry <laughs> uniting between us were completely organic, quickly transforming into raw lust. <laughs>